In today's episode of Mysteries of History, we are looking at one of the largest churches in Asia built to commemorate the victory of the Portuguese army over the Muslim rule prevailing that time. Saint Catherine of Alexandria was venerated by the Portuguese in Goa because it was on her feast day that Albuquerque was successful in reconquering Goa from the Adil Shah of Bijapur. So she became a great blessing for the Portuguese. And that is the reason the Portuguese dedicate, also dedicated a bigger church as the Say Cathedral to her memory. Uh, before the Portuguese came uh, to Goa, see Goa was, um, you know, more of, as we say, the name itself, you know, for Goa was like a cowherd's country. So basically it was agrarian. It was more agricultural. And the Goans were very peaceful people. Now you had different kingdoms. So whether it was the Kadambas, whether it was Vijayanagar, you know, earlier we had the Bojas and so many other Satvahanas. All these were different kingdoms. Some were local, some were from the neighboring states, Karnataka or Maharashtra. They came, they captured. But, you know, the Goan life was mostly revolving around this. Agriculture was one, then, you know, religion and their local customs and all. Much more connected with the sea because Goa all, all along is coast. And therefore, you know, it was connected with the coast, with the sea. So fishing, agriculture, as I said, all these were uh, part of the, of the Goan milieu at that time before the Portuguese came. It took 57 years to complete construction of this church. This architectural wonder, Say Cathedral, has been declared a World Heritage Site by UNESCO. The history traces back to the time of Dominicans who were the first missionaries to be sent to India by the Portuguese. This cathedral was designed by the muscular stalwart engineers Ambrosio Aguirre and Julio Simão. The word Se in Portuguese means sea. The Se Cathedral was built to commemorate the victory of the Portuguese under Afonso de Albuquerque over a Muslim army, leading to the capture of the city of Goa in 1510. Since the day of the victory happened to be on the feast of St. Catherine, the cathedral was dedicated to her. It was commissioned by Governor George Cabral to be enlarged in 1552 on the remains of an earlier structure. Construction of the church began in 1562 in the reign of King Dom Sebastian. The cathedral was completed in 1619 and was consecrated in 1640. It had two towers, but one collapsed in 1776 when lightning struck it and was never rebuilt. In 1953, the cathedral was presented with the Golden Rose by Venerable Pope Pius XII. The Golden Rose is a gold ornament which the popes of the Catholic Church have traditionally blessed and conferred as a token of reverence or affection. It is placed on the tomb of Saint Francis Xavier. Julian Simão, the architect of most of the churches in Old Goa, lies buried there. The Say Cathedral has beautiful eight chapels. The mystery of the growing cross is here, the Saint Dominic's Chapel, and it is one of the magnificent churches, the principal churches in the whole of Asia, and it is a World Heritage Monument. The architecture style of the Say Cathedral is Portuguese, Manueline. The exterior is Tuscan, whereas the interior is Corinthian. The church is 250 feet, that is 76 meters in length and 181 feet, 
55 meters in breadth. The frontispiece stands 115 feet or 35 meters high. The interior of the cathedral is majestic and it has a high vaulted ceiling. Its body excluding the four chapels on each side. The Se Cathedral's tower houses a large bell known as the Golden Bell on account of its rich tone. It is one of the biggest church bells of Goa and one of the best in the world. The main altar is dedicated to Catherine of Alexandria and there are several old paintings on either side of it. On the right, there is a chapel of the Cross of Miracles where a vision of Christ is said to have appeared in 1619. There are six main panels on which scenes from the life of Saint Catherine are carved. The Se Cathedral also houses a baptismal font made in 1532 which was used by Saint Francis Xavier in order to baptize several Goan converts. There is a large painting of Saint Christopher which is placed near the church choir. There are eight chapels in Se Cathedral. The four on the left belong to Our Lady of Virtues, Saint Sebastian, the Blessed Sacrament and Our Lady of Life. The ones on the right are dedicated to Saint Anthony, Saint Bernard, the Cross of Miracles and the Holy Ghost. The chapels are ornamented with marvelous lattice work. The chapels of the Blessed Sacrament and the Cross of Miracles are cloistered behind finely filigreed wooden screens. No visit to Goa could be considered complete without gazing at the awe-inspiring art and architecture of this most revered cathedral.